Need a tripod? You want to use this? I'm just, it's, you just rest it on top. I heard an explode. I was at Kara. I heard a big bang about half an hour ago when I was having coffee. I, don't know what that, I looked around, there was no light. And then I went outside and I was driving away and I saw this huge plume, plume of smoke going across the sky. And I looked around and went, fuck, it's a trace. You're just holding it on there? Yeah. You want to use it? Yeah. yeah. Okay. You want to go on top? You can go on top of mine. Yes. Go ahead. Come on. No, I just, I got up, I think I heard it about a half hour ago. I was, like in, I was on Humboldt Street. Mm -hmm. yeah. they, they, the they, they closed it, they wouldn't they let us on, and they diverted all the traffic, so we've been you sitting. Never seen so many Yo, go and then as we were driving down here on the VQE, everybody was stopped, I mean stopped dead watching, because they, you could see everything. Two planes hit. That's shit. what they say. Yeah. Two planes? Yeah. Two planes. Two, planes. two small planes. And, that, and that just as I got off the line, uh, I mean, got off, got out of the car, and they, they said the FBI said there were two skyjack, hijack. Yeah. But, yeah, everything's all. That's what they just said on the radio. Oh, really? Yeah. This is just like a bad movie. No, this is just bad life, man. Like today. Can you, Jen, can you, well, you can't okay, I gotta make sure my car, my car is out there whenever I'm being haunted. Uh, can you get both of them? Um, oh, it's just resting? Yeah. You got this? Yeah. <laughs> I did. I think I heard it. I, you know, I mean. But I look at this like giant hole burning in the They think it's two air, from what we yeah, can tell. They say it's two airplanes. Two airplanes, but I think they, and they're talking about hijack. 
Yeah. Really? I mean, it's all sketchy now, but it's like, this is seriously fucked up, man. It's gotta be a Kamikaze tourist attack somewhere. I just wanna knock these buildings down to call them a Has <laughs> anybody got a radio over there? Yeah. You saw, you saw the thing go? This is fucked up. It's, uh, there's a... You can see in through to the back wall. It's the first one. Can you get that? Can you zoom in that close? Yeah. I think you got better zoom than I do. Though. It's ditch, but it's not a resolution. Well, here. I got optical up to like ten times and then six times. Uh, Sixty times. There you go. Somebody got a radio down there. Okay. Got to shoot it down. I seen I seen like a black cow before. So you really saw this helicopter? Come over, come over here, cause I'm. Working. Can you come here? Cause it's like. Because I want to get your, so I don't want your name or anything. Sure. It's like, tell me what happened. I mean, no, 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 just off camera. Oh, good, thank you. Yeah. <laughs> no, I saw one of them on fire about two minutes before I got here. No, tell the story when you heard it. Well, I heard, I was trying to get on the Williamsburg. They, they closed it down, so I tried to get onto the Williamsburg. And the ramp, and I turned my car down a one-way street, and I got to the stop sign, and I saw one tower on fire. I said, oh, my God. The north one, there. The, the bigger one, yeah. the one that's higher up. And then I saw a plane behind it with a helicopter following it, and it was way too low and too close that he was going over the river. And he was way too low. Like the East River or the, or the Hudson? The uh, Hudson. Yeah. And he was coming from behind the tower when there was a helicopter trailing. And then by the time I got here, it was two minutes. And then as I'm pulling down the street, the 1010 10 wind said, we heard another explosion. Did anybody tell us well, that I, was I, plane? See, I was having coffee on Humboldt Street in the back. And all of a sudden yeah. I heard like, I don't know, about a half hour, 40 minutes ago, whenever it was, I heard like this bang. I'm like, wow. Well, I saw that. And, and I, I thought it was up. light. Yeah. Or thunder. And then it's like, I look around and I go, that's weird. And then I got out and drove and I saw that. thing. I pull up and, and they said there was another explosion. Somebody said, I think that was debris from the first, from the first tower. Yeah. And they said, you sure it wasn't another plane? Could you confirm it was another plane? By the time I pulled up, I put two and two together. And as soon as I walked up, some guy said, a second plane just with the other tower. And I said, my God. I wonder if that's the plane I saw. Like, the thing was flying way too low. And why would a helicopter be trailing? Right. You know? Holy fucking shit. I hate to say this, but this looks like some bad oh, payback. Yeah. Is there a radio? Somebody got a radio down there? Yeah. So let's go, let's go next to somebody who's got a radio. I don't know, I just heard. So what I, you know, I heard about it on the radio, I turned the TV on, I grabbed my camera and I went up to the roof. I was taking pictures of the, of the tower on the right. Right. At first. And then, in about five minutes, I saw another plane come from the left and hit the other tower. It was a jet liner. Fuck that. This is, it's terrorism because it was two jet planes. And at least, the, I know the second one was a jet plane. Well, the service on the jet planes are coming back up here. This is like the most horrible thing I've ever seen in my life. And when that plane hit, when the second one hit, I witnessed it. I was just like, oh, I didn't know what to think. Okay. I'm shaking. I mean, 
I was supposed, I was trying to go down there. I got a new car yesterday. I had to register the car. I was ready to go down there this morning. Jesus. So is anybody gonna go? I just bought a train ticket last night to go to Montreal tomorrow morning to see the Picasso Erotique show. Now it's like, I don't know what to do right now. <laughs> All of them are closed? Yeah. It had to be terrible. So. Well, that second one, dude, it's like, this is a mistake. <coughs> so you actually, how did it, did it come in? Which side did it come in? It, it came in from um, the lower Manhattan? The, the left tower, yeah. It came in right about about the level of the bottom of the smoke and just hit straight in. On this side or the and side that we're looking at or the side it, behind it us? It was slightly behind us. That was an airline. It was definitely an airliner. And you, you said you saw the first one? Yeah, the first one. Somebody was, you saw it? I just left my son in school. I saw the tone. Can you come over here so I can get just your voice on it? I'm a, no, I'm not, I don't. I can't stand up. No, I want to see what, um, just tell the story what you heard. It was just like a big explosion. We went into the pool for a second, but we were here, but we found that we were down. The second one was coming from the left side. Down. Yeah, that's, um, there was why is it she's right? Three helicopters, three police helicopters. Did, 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 you, saw, did you see a helicopter follow the second one? No. It came in, it came in like this, like she said, and then it turned like that. So the boat on that bridge, you see the plane. When it turned, it went right into it on the side. You see, we can see like the triangle from here moving on to the other side. But the first one, was it an airline? No, was it a big airplane? Look small. The one that hit the second time to the page. Yeah. So that thought. doesn't look like that hole in that northern tower doesn't look like a small airplane. The first one is. They had to be. I think I think they were both airliners. I mean, that, that second one was definitely an airliner. Bridge, the bridge, and it's really freaky. I've never seen anything so far in my life. Uh, you saw it. I saw the second one. I've never seen anything so scary in my life. Tim. Okay. I was on my roof. Yeah. I was taking pictures of the first one. I was up there about five minutes. And the second one hit. And then, you know, I see another airplane. I'm like, God, where's that one heading to? Jesus. I mean, it was hit. It's the strangest, the strangest thing was like between the first and the second one was like attributed to an accident. And when the second one hit, you just knew it was yeah. terrorism. Some serious badass payback. I'm glad. I the jets are ready now. I like about 10 minutes, but you can see all the see all the way through to the back wall of the, the right one. The northern one? Yeah. It's sad to hear people talking about it too. Because, you know, thousands of people just died. It's cut off on the battle part of the railways in the fire. It's the pipe damage, yes? It's not regular fire anymore. It's mechanical damage. It's you don't have any speaker system. You don't have any, you don't have any. Anything from the top. Everybody better go home and check that your mother and field their calls for them. Well, it's step Sorry. My father's second wife. That's good. Everyone above that is fine. You know? That's I mean, horrible. Like, there's no way anyone in the right tower is making it down. 
No, anyone, anyone even like within a few floors of the bottom of that fire. Yeah, this is I mean, see now, you can see it starting to really burn on the other one. It's a perfectly mastermind thing, you know, you don't need to drive a truck, you don't need to have a bomb, all you need is to grab a plane. That's it. Well, someone said that the, from the explosion of the first one, it had been like pretty loaded. You think it was loaded with explosives? Yeah, they said it was like just black. But it could have been a plane I, I, just taking off. I doubt that. You know, a plane I don't, I don't just taking off is full of fuel. I don't, I don't, I think the, the conspiracy to be able to load a plane with explosives is, is too complicated. Mm -hmm. Just crashing it in is, is fine. You know, it does enough damage on its own. I think that, that damage looks just like any plane with full, full jet fuel and it yeah, just took off on the bloody units. Where'd it come from anyways? I don't know. I mean, uh, I'm sure within a few minutes they, you know, they'll know where these planes came from, where they took off from last, and where radar tracked them from. I was going to go down there to business today. But. Everybody in creation over there. They got what? They got everybody in creation from the city. So what? what's going on now? Can you tell? Yeah, two planes. One is supposedly a commercial airline. I don't know about the other one, what it was all about, because I didn't see the unit. They say the first or second one was a commercial airline. First or and the second one, they said the first one. No, the first yeah. or the second one. No, the first one. Because I thought the second one looked like a commercial airline. I don't know. They, they closed down. They notified the Air Force. They want uh, any planes in the area of New York City, they want them shot down. Any unauthorized planes in the area, they want them shot down. Really? Yeah. So what's the scoop with the... Uh, how are they going to fight this fire? Well, I guess they're doing what they can. I don't know. Yeah, you can I can do, tell you right? one thing. It's a, it's a, it, the sprinklers went off, right? Look at this. Can you believe that? Look. What can we do except, Every what ambulance can we do except available? let it burn out? I mean, you know, you don't have a sprinkler system that can deal with something like that that starts with that explosion. They have jumpers. People jumped on the upper floors. What are you going to do? Fire no, I know. I mean, you know, you, you face, you're faced with that, that's what you do. Here we go, here we go. Duty guys going in because they're li leaving at nine o'clock, so they want everybody on. So they got double the uh, double the amount of them to fight it. Can we get that on the tape? Yes. Can you hold it there? Or is it okay. Okay. They wanted the Empire State Building safeguarded. I'm sure everybody's out of that building. No, they was, but I'm saying they want everything safeguarded. Yeah. Oh, the first one you can look at it and say, well, it was an accident. The second one, yeah, you just immediately change the whole thing. Everybody remembers the vote today. I don't think I don't know what they're going to do. They're going to close down the city. I don't think they're going to close down the city. I don't think they're going to close
right now the big question is if there are commercial airlines, were they empty or were they unsuspecting passengers on flights that got rerouted? People are going to be dead on this. This is really fucked up. Go ahead, you. 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 Yeah, no idea. They just asked for every single ambulance in the city of New York that's available. This is so fucking hard to get there. I see the second one. You saw it? Yeah, the second one. Normally when they have something big, they call it level mobile one and level two. They immediately call them not level two, it's probably up to about level eight or nine. That's what it is. Because they have to, they have to test everybody. Got an okay. Republicans, Democrats were willing to die for what they believe in. Democrats are willing to kill for what they believe in. Which one of them goes with? Democrats. Democrats are willing to die for what they believe in, and Republicans are willing to kill for what they believe in. Now, is that his name? I never. I never. <laughs> you're not going to remove. You said Ted Kaczynski. I, I never, I never thought Democrats were really good on that. In the Unabomber <laughs> Manifesto. Yep. Uh, you know, I think he got one thing right. So she said the, uh, the old White House? Or the well, White the House? executive office building, which is next to the White House. Right. Was there yeah, smoke coming from? Five hour bridge, they got the bomb squad hanging, they got a suspicious package. Uh, but everything is going to be like that anyway. Right? It's going to be like that for days. I think, I think this is the, the target that was hit, and they're, you know. The fact that where's the Empire State Building this far from I'm now. sure, yeah. I would have been sliding down the banisters there if I were in that building. It's really, really amazing. I've got to hear the first copy of the Well, the news copies. Well, they did. They probably got their airspace cut down. They were told to get out of here because no one was. There are no planes coming in or out of this area. No, they were told. I, I understand something. That they uh, informed the, the uh, commission that informed the uh, uh, air force to shoot in here on Walter Rice Point. That would be unbelievable. 
The military type plane, somebody said there was a military type plane, was the second one? No, the second one was a jetliner. You saw it? I saw it, yeah. I, I, I would swear on that. What was it? They said U.S. Air. I would make sense if it was coming from Boston, you know, if it was a shuttle that was hijacked. But I don't know whether that was the first one or the second one that was from Boston. I work nights. I don't even use me on two, 200 at night anyway. Yeah, it's not clear. Is it clear? Is it clear? No. Yeah, it's clear. There's a guy here. Uh, the guy hanging off the side of the building. Uh huh. Well, that's all, that's all can you see now? I can see, you can see something there. Where? Right in the middle of the left tower, just below the black. No, no, it's just, just a lens, a 500 millimeter lens. I haven't used this lens in six years. I don't see the two guys. Oh, no, no, yeah, you can see where you can see it. Well, you can see where you see it. Did you see it on there? But I think that could also be the breeze that they're hanging out. Might be debris, might be people. That's debris. Is that debris? Yeah, you can't see a person. Is it debris or people? It's debris or people. Did you see something here? Yeah. Oh. Yeah, people probably, right? That's debris. Is it real? Yeah, people. I have both of them. You see constantly falling down. I'm wondering whether you're going to see a structural failure. Yeah, people hanging off the window. I'm wondering how, this, how long this could hold. There's a lot of pressure on that. It's like if it gets hot enough, it'll melt the steel and it'll fail. It'll go down, right? Well, the frame is still intact. The train's still running. Yeah. I bet everybody has a camera on board, too. Sad to say, another reason to look at it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Mid South has like a fire going. Yeah, I know, yeah, yeah. There's going to be like a lot of disasters. Yeah, a lot of disasters. Would you do me a favor? Yeah. I'm going to go get my. Uh, All right, we'll check out. Out. You want to get that track on? You want to hear it? Well, no, just, yeah. Should I turn it off? Yes. By yourself, correct? Uh, he's turning there by yourself. All right, 10-4. Thank you. Well, I'm going to go over to the track and try and let them know it's died.
This is seriously fucking bad. This is like the worst thing I've ever, you know, it's the worst thing I've ever... No, this is just the beginning of it. That thing's in a block hole. 3501 Central. No, I'm talking about it. This is really fucked up. Apparently they hit the Pentagon. Sounds like there's a major assault going on. That's the one. Did you see those white flickering they things? They declared the yesterday. Yesterday. What? They declared the yesterday. Well, they, they always have terrorists. Yeah. 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 They always have terrorists. They always have terrorists. Can you uh, exact location for us? Yeah, buddy. Both locations now. Look at 3501. Be advised it's supposedly at the Queen's. I think if anything, it's people waving pieces of paper. Yeah, well, on the, on the way, yeah. Yeah, but I don't think they would be surviving. They can't be beautiful now. Who knows? You can focus it. You can yeah, to the no. left if you want to go to the right. It's a helicopter going on top. Can you see the helicopter? Where? Yeah, in the back. On the, on the north tower. Oh, above it, yeah. All right, Jeff. Jet fuel in there that went from the plane when it hit also and I don't think this was ever made for this steel, kind of situation. Steel, yeah, steel melts at like 500, 550. Jesus Christ, man. You said it right. It was burning too much into the uniform. You don't know who the hell was down on the bottom. Five fires down here. I don't fucking believe it. I don't fucking believe this. This is the worst thing that has practically ever happened in the world. Short of Pearl Harbor, I would say so. What? Short of Pearl Harbor, I would say this well, is the worst. Well, a little bit more people died here. There you go. What? Look at all these guys sitting coming downtown. I don't know. They're going into a certain... Uh, we're going into a certain mode right now. Okay, advise all units to go to direct. So we're going to down. Oh, 
this is like set everybody up from the schools and everything. This is you know, a national emergency. It's, what's going on? In the, that's a train. Come on, get the other one out. The second, the second plane was a lower hit. I mean, it was probably more critical. What in the west go? This is oh god, this is so horrible. This is so horrible. The train's still running. The other one, I think they got the fire. You know. The other one was the other one first one. It was more critical. Almost dead center. Can you hear me? Can you hear me? Look how much dust is in that lower Manhattan. Now. It's covering imagine, the Lower East Side. I can't imagine what the other buildings nearby have been. They've been destroyed. Yesterday. This is the kind of thing that you, like, you know. You read theoretical things about okay, what's going on. At 9, 8.55, I came out of the Cattery Tunnel. I had to go to the ESU-1. I had to go across the night. So, and this happened just around the end. That thing didn't come straight down either, man. It took... But it, yeah, yeah, it kind of... Was can. Yeah, this was not an implant. ESU-1. Yeah, this is a failure. The lead eventually, the lead eventually just got it. Go to FD. The FD would give you more. These are, they, they're, they're on the, all their other radios. There you go. Division one. Can you hold this for a second? There are a lot of dead people there. Okay. Uh, Manhattan Division, Manhattan, uh, Manhattan, uh, the whole thing collapsed? Manhattan Coronado, the urgent. Well, it hit them. Here, like, put your arm in. Manhattan Coronado, the urgent. We had fire here, and it was burning. Here you go, what's this? Hi, right, Manhattan, what are you doing? I'm operating at the fifth of all, West Street, or Liberty Street, with tower number two, any unit king. Yeah, they can't get the guys in the tower. I can't get the guys that are in the tower. Any unit operating number two World Trade Center at the collapse. Contact my hand my radio, forthwith. Take me to Bravo. Yeah, that's right, right away. Yeah. 
It didn't seem to be any explosion though before the collapse, right? It was just 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 You can't have that much heat. On the next that next one is gonna come down too. It's running all the way around. This is some kind of assault. This is some kind of assault. They really want to paralyze the city, they keep the bridges. No, they don't. It's 40,000 people working in these two buildings. Look at it whatever you want. No, it's okay, thanks. Actually, the overall view, I hate, I hate the tight, tight shots. Dude, that sounds like air force. The jets? Yeah, you want to take a sign here, you go. You want to take a look at the jets? USF, see you go. Those uh, military jets? Clouds, the World Trade Center, the South Tower. Any long more the building went down than we took? That was a very, very big structure. And that's it right now. The stock exchange is okay. The thing fell towards the stock. The like city's going to be down for a while. This is like civilian, you know, this is time for everybody to ask what to do to help and where do we go, how do we, how do we all go over there and organize and help.
should probably evacuate the people. We had second alarms. Well, second. So they were like, so like, like, 12 pieces of equipment for one spot. So they had different locations. Yeah, but I won't building the email. Yeah, the guy down here has the camera. We got fucking horses. Seventh Avenue is wide open. Ten four. Ten four. All units going into the World Trade Center. Be advised, Line One Four Report. Seventh Avenue is wide open. It also is West Side Highway is open. All units going into the Fifth Alarm. Seventh Avenue is wide open. Ten four. Ten four. Seventh Avenue is wide open. All units going into the Fifth Alarm. West Side Highway is open, and Seventh Avenue is open at this time. As for Line One Four. One One Five Four One Six. West Side Highway is open. That's amazing. Oh, that's just Nobody's moving. Thank you. 
To me, this is the one that still looked like it was listing. The other one didn't look like it was. No, the other when I measured it, I mean when I aligned it on the edge of the camera, it looked like the other one was leaning into the frame. But I don't know whether this is like. Why don't you line it up against these brick buildings by the waterfront and then zoom, then go up, see if you can line it with one of those and give you a good edge. No, I just do it on the edge of this. It's like you can't. But you don't know whether this is level. But right. the building is. No, I'm just. I'm saying it's like it looks like it's on one side. It's Boeing on the left side. Here, use the uh, show the telescope. Hold the radio. I got the. Uh, you, you know, we're moving 
They said if the building collapses, it will fall on Stuyvesant High School. Really? He was right. Uh, New York City, just for citywide, go. Well, it'll fall on Stuyvesant High School because it's failing the south. Uh, 18, 18 supervisors on there. 18 supervisors. 18 supervisors on there. Operation, be advised, we have to 
Pentagon's been hit. Capital. Hill. Operation go. They say that uh, yeah, the CUS is the call one. Call one. Empty space. Empty space. Completely done. Call one. Where is this? Is the World Trade Center? Yes. Yeah, 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 we, we saw it go. Fall or fall. Emergency yeah. damage. The call um. Collapse. Fall or fall. Call one. Yeah. CUS is the call one. Call one. Looks like there was never a building there. You know, when, when it went when it went down, I could see like it was tunnel. Yeah, it seemed like it just sort of... Oh, no, 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 no. Go this way. Oh, my God. I hear it. Thank you. 